Uh, James, Jess, um, can I just start with Jess, you pranking James on your previous movie mm -hmm. that you did together. I know that James, in a really serious scene, Jess played the Macarena mm -hmm. uh, in one of the most profound scenes in the last movie. Do you make a habit of um, trying to put him there off during scenes? There were no pranks scenes? in this one. There were no pranks in this one. We were up against it. We were it. afraid of our li for our lives in this one. <laughs> yeah. We were like, if anything goes wrong. Well, I think it's where we were just generally exhausted in this yeah. one because it was just so physically demanding. And when you're covered in blood for maybe four yeah. weeks in an air-conditioned room, freezing your arse off, I don't really feel like we were in the mood for, uh, for that. <laughs> Although we did, we did keep we each other's space up. We did have a good time. But, but usually off really... set, there was a lot of like karaoke and, and yeah. meals. And there was stuff. less pranking on set. Yeah. The, the blood is quite something washed off every day, or did you just think, if I'm going to be in it tomorrow, <laughs> I'll just sleep in it? No, I, I bathed. <laughs> I will say that it... <laughs> bathed, <baby. laughs> It, um, when I left the set though, I didn't realize that it had dyed my hair. No. Because they would pour it, so in some scenes they just, then they kept pouring it over my head. Um, and so, like on the top of my hair, it was, it was dyed a darker red. This is a lot more than just a horror film, you know, this uh, psychological drama and about mm -hmm. this. But what's your biggest uh, irrational or rational fear of something happening on set? On so, set? Yeah, like uh. trousers falling down or sh showing up without any clothes on. If I do have nightmares, it's a panic dream, and it usually is like, I, it's I end up, I'm like, okay, I'm about to go on stage for a play I've already done, like maybe I did a, oh, a play yeah. years ago, and I'm there, I'm back there, and I'm like, I just don't, I can't remember the first line, and then trying to figure out, well, does someone have a script? Does someone have a script? And that feeling, of, and then trying to figure out and remember <sighs> what it was. That to me is a. Is I have a, almost the exact same dream. Uh, as you do, except for me, I'm getting ready to go on for the play that I've rehearsed and I know, and somebody comes by and goes, oh, by the way, we're doing Uncle Vanya tonight. And I'm like, I've, I barely know Uncle Vanya. I'm like, oh, who am I? I'm, who who am I, I I'm Astro. I'm Astro. <laughs> what is, what I'm is Astro. the first line? What do you do? <laughs> okay, I'm like, I know the first four lines. Oh, come on, come on. <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> but and no <laughs> nightmares about Pennywise, though. No, no, no thoughts yes, about Bill. Yes, I had nightmares about Pennywise. I did. When you close your eyes, you see Bill. No. Uh, Every well, time you close your eyes. Just think of England. <laughs> Only when I'm, uh, you know, that's, no. Um, <laughs> I had a couple of nightmares about Pennywise uh, when we were in rehearsals, actually. Which is weird, because I read the book as a kid and it didn't really freak me out, but as an adult, it did actually freak me out and gave me Penny, uh, Pennywise hmm. nightmares. He's Penny in us all, really, isn't he? Mares. What? He's in us all. No. He's not in me. <laughs> no. He's not me. I'm just afraid of him. <laughs> But we he's all not all up in me. <laughs> but he's definitely not getting in me. <laughs> <laughs> Even if he strokes your back. Even if he strokes my back like he did in my dream. No. <laughs> oh, what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Y